Hey guys, welcome back to another Hypixel UNC. I kind of want to go for leaderboards now that I'm actually getting a chance to go for it just because all these hackers are getting banned off of it. So it's kind of moved me up a couple of positions and lowered down the requirements for how many wins I actually need to get on the solo win leaderboards. However, it's still like 50 games away, so that's not really going to be something in the near future, but it could be an option. I'm really feeling the pollen allergies. I think I forgot to take my allergy medication yesterday, so uh, that's kind of regrettable, but oh well. Actually, it's not really oh well, it's kind of like a, I probably should have done it. I have a lot of regret. If I sound like 10 times even more dead than usual, I mean, yeah, I already sound like I'm basically on my deathbed, so it's probably not helping me very much right now, but that's what you have to deal with here. I'm also kind of laggy, so I don't know how well my ping is going to hold up during this game, but hopefully it's not too bad. I don't want to dig straight down here, but there's people around, so it's kind of bad right now. There's somebody down there, so I don't want to go. We could get these lily pads, actually. Maybe we can make hide later with those. And I think we can just head out this section right here. Just dig straight down, honestly. My sea count is pretty high. And I'm going to dig southwards to avoid the other person in that other section of the cave. There's still a name tag around me, so I can't really smelt up right now. But I think once we eliminate that person, we should be all set to go. Okay, that skeleton arrow just like you turned on me. I don't even know how that's possible, but whatever. I'm going to ignore that happening because I'm lagging. So whatever you see when you're lagging, just... It's some spooky stuff, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I could definitely get a spot to get this location, so I'm just gonna do that. I think this is gonna be one of those games where you have a lot of healing to work with, but not really the diamonds to work with to match it, so... Gonna need to play smart here. As long as I make good decisions and use my healing wisely, I don't quick drop, then we should be all set. Oh my god, that... That really scared me, I'm not gonna lie. I think we can get away with not smelting more iron, as long as we don't make a second bucket here. Honestly, screw the lava bucket, I don't care enough about it, and honestly, I forgot to use it half the time anyways, unless I'm obby trapping, so... You know what, we're gonna avoid it with lava bucket, we're not making one of those. I have six gaps to work with, which would be really, really good, but my armor is really bad, so I'm gonna have to work around it, really. At least we have a sharp three iron. Could be worse. And I guess we're just gonna have to use an effort as this game, but honestly, I'm pretty sure I'm never gonna touch that thing. I mean, I rarely ever use my fire secondaries, so who knows what I'm doing. And I think I'm gonna save enough gold for a jihad too, just because I don't think I need six gaps to kill somebody. And if I need six gaps as a full iron, I'm pretty much dead afterwards anyway, so... Let's try to get a rod, but I think 0, zero was a snow bomb, so I might not need to grab one. I was right, 0, zero is a snow bomb, so I don't need to worry about it. Having a rod at this point, I can just grab a bunch of these things and try to pull something off. For the person with the tarred helm right there, that is somebody I really want to fight here. I have no clue what's going on here, so I'm just going to wait for the cleanup here. Oh, wait, what? Somebody just fell off the sky base. I asked if we could just grab the head right here. No, they got it, so I'm just going to back out again. Actually, let's fight this person with the tarred helm right here. Actually, Hello Darkness might clean, I'm not too sure. And there's somebody coming off the sky base too. But I think I can just back out this person for free, honestly. Actually, no, I can't because they're just bowing. I did not see the ocean. I was lagging a little bit. So I'm going to back out again. With the lag, I want to heal up the full basically at any chance I get. I'm still getting cleaned, so I don't want to actually go all in here. Uh, we'll just see what we can do here. Because everybody's digging. Is he tracing the person in the water or no? No, he's not. Actually, I think he's coming for me. Oh, okay. Right, I see you, buddy. I see you. Let's fight this, though. Okay, I'm not lagging right now, but I do want to heal up the full ones again. That was a really good fire right there. And we are comboing them. For 10. That was our last gap, I'm pretty sure. They're 14. I'm gonna gap up here. It should be a two hit. Yeah, we got him. So we're still looking okay. And that's really what you gotta do here with this type of gear is you gotta make sacrifices to get more armor. So basically I just had to sacrifice all my healing for armor, but that's honestly worthwhile in this situation. Morse is at 15 though. Did they ever dig up here? 
No, I don't think they did. I could get three forts diamond off of them, so I'm gonna actually choose a dig here. I see them in the cave right over there, so we should be able to kill them real easily. Hey, buddy. That worked out a lot better than I thought it would. But I just saw their name tags, so I knew I could find them. I actually want to go for Dinah, because they have pants for me, which means I can make hide after I killed them. So this is what I want to go for right here. And maybe they have some more iron for me. It's just Kaven who's a three star, so I should be able to take them. Hopefully they try to melee, actually. They have a drag sword, I think. That's oh, actually bloodlust, I'm pretty sure. Never mind. They're dead. Dinah just killed the other person, so I need to go after them. And I have everything for hide once I get the kills, so that's perfect. They're over this way, so we can just find them. Oh, they're right there, actually. Perfect. I need this for hide so badly. I think they're going to try to melee rush me with the head. Pretty, pretty good, though. Are they jaded? Oh, jaded back on them. I'm kind of lagging again. I probably should not jaded from that range, but I was getting ghosted, so I thought I needed to eat it. They're gapping up again here. That's a pretty good lava. Oh my god, they're actually pretty good. They're 20. They just need another GN. I think they have more gaps though, at least. I'm just gonna eat another GN on them. Add lava on them. Please drop with gaps. They're kind of laggy though, so it's kind of hard to get a combo on them. They're five though. We got him here. Okay. How many gaps do they drop with? Multiple. Two gaps. Very good stuff. And that's hide right there. That just makes some pro armor. And we have sharp three bloodlust now, which is great. And we have a bow and a rod now too. So this has been really good. We've kind of just made a slow progression through armor pieces, but it's worked out pretty well in my opinion. Get a pro two chest blade up. And get pro two boots up. All right, now we're looking much better. A lot of times you can honestly just make a pretty good slow progression through different armor pieces. And eventually you'll work your way up to being very stacked. You don't always need to take down a full diamond or go for some big exchange. Like you could just go for some one pieces and stuff and build your way up. Just remembering where people are is just very, very good. Okay, there's another full iron. This is the type of person we want to fight right here. Togi, they're at 31. They probably have some gaps on them or something. And they literally have no clue what they're doing. So this is good. They're in a cave actually. I think they're trying to trap me. Honestly, I'm not opposed. I don't know what trap they have here. They got a backstab. Oh, okay. But I'm not sure if they have one of those piston things. So I'm going to take past the pistons. Oh, they're going to try to spleef me in right here. So I'm going to avoid that and dig it a 2 by 2 And I'm going to go J-hop them now. They went farther down here. We might have a head editor there, so I'm going to avoid that. And we're just going to go past them here and kill them. Someone else is digging, I'm pretty sure. Are they even less geared than me? I'm going to jet on them. I almost obviate them. That would have been nice. But at least we have sharp four bloodlust now. Did the loot fall down here? No, I don't really know where it is, actually. I think they picked up the other person's head somehow. And they ate that, so... That's okay. No, actually, I have the head. Never mind, it's up there. That was the type of quick drop action I needed. It's just that they unluckily did not have any extra healing on them, so... Oh, wait, what? I have eight gaps. Never mind, they had tons of extra healing on them. I did not even look at my hotbar. Right, this person says frozen is bad as cheating. Okay. I think that's the type of cheater who wouldn't be e hoppy at least, so that's that. But I have so many cool blocks. Oh, that's that's them. Okay, well, we're just gonna bow spam then. They're just spam eating heads, that's fine. And their armor's really not good either. Okay, I'm both spamming them super hard though, which is very good for me. They're at 13 here, they're at 10. They had another Geod on me, but I saw their hand afterwards. And the person behind them has modular bow actually. The 
I'm just gonna keep rod spamming them, honestly. Orengi's behind them and they have mod bow, so I need to wait for the death match to fight them, I think. But honestly, Frozen did nothing. He really had no clue what he was doing, so I'm fine. We all have hide, though. It's kind of weird. Like, we're all facing the same armor. Frozen's the 14, but I don't know if they have more heads left. I also don't want to one by one to get murdered by Orengi afterwards. My extra prot levels never hurt. There's nothing better for me to do. Actually, I could just pass it. What am I doing? It's kind of dumb. It's this way. Okay. Oh my god, we actually found somebody. There are 24 here. They just stood still. There's no, but if I just hit some bow shots, we should be fine. They're at 19. 12. One more, one more bow shot. Come on. Got him. That was a really good kill right here. Just an extra head and some more gold. Got all the gold too. Oh my god. All right, we'll just craft the jet here. I think everybody here is full diameter, basically, right? I think... Yeah, they're hacking. Okay, yeah, that's not legit. I don't want to waste my next yet though. I actually do have to. Oh my god. I had to use all my GS just to run for this man. I need help from these other people at Deathmatch. Okay, we're not dead, so that's something. He's gonna get a lot of kills here. We all have hide. What is this? This is crazy. And hey, whatever, we're just gonna go oh frozen for a while here. I guess he's going for a Ranky here. I'll just keep bowing them down though. I'm just gonna let everybody run around me. I don't, I don't really mind. Oh, okay. Never mind. Ranky, I need to save you. There's six though. Okay, you know, I'm gonna go kill them. I guess this fire, so he's gonna get a big advantage here. I got the kill. I got the head actually, and I got the armor, so that's fusion right there. We did not get the sword though, so that's the only issue here. Fusion legs, oh my god, that's bad. Wait, we have eight kills. We might be able to get the ten actually, and be able to get sharp five here. So where's where's blue? I need to find blue. Oh, they just died. Never mind. I think Poseidon got the fire sword. If I get the happy boy stuff though, I do get another fusion piece, which is gonna be big. I'm just gonna run around a little bit. I still have seven gaps, which is a ton. And honestly, let me just go in for them. Oh, that's a good shot by me. Oh, I'm destroying them. <laughs> Meet the head. They're dead right here. There's no way. I'm just out again. They have the fire sword. I don't think it's a drag sword at least, so that's something. But here I see the craft some fusion armor again. Let's make a Gied first. Fusion armor. We got boots. Okay, that's good. And I'm gonna go repair my chest blade so it doesn't break. I need one more kill for sharp five too, so that's pretty good also. But we really are just making the right decisions here. I think Aregi's next. Okay, I repaired my chest blade. That's good. So now all my armor is looking really strong again. I don't know how much heal they have actually. They weren't even full diamond going to deathmatch, so that's something to look forward to. I think they can't have a better sword than me. There's no way they have sharp five fire either. I think they are legit. The good thing I got rid of the main threat though. Yeah, that sword does not really do that much, honestly. But they're not that good. Alright, we're good. I'm gonna just run away here. I don't want them to have the advantage of head speed. I don't want to waste the jet still. Oh, you didn't know I have to. They're 24. They're very low here. I'm just gonna gap up again. They're, they're healing, so that's the problem. Actually, Rengi has like no healing. He's not healed at all. 
I don't know what he has, but I don't want to waste my last shield yet. I kind of just had to do it because Orangi bowed me. It's because he thought I was low, so I didn't want to get dropped there. I was just trying to preserve it so that I didn't have to eat it. And if he bowed the other person thinking that he was the real threat, then I wouldn't have been forced into eating the Jihad there. So that was okay, at least. I mean, I got out of there alive. But yeah, I think bowing down Orangi is the best decision at the moment. He says lol. I think he thinks of Tracy or something. Or maybe Orangi is like right behind me. Oh, he's right here. Oh, that's why, because I think I was teaming. I didn't even realize he was here, to be honest. I'm kind of blind. I honestly don't know how much healing our ring he has. I think I saw his head after he ate that gap. I think he's out. Maybe a head left, but... I don't think he has much. He says zero heals. Yeah, I think he's right. I honestly think he's not lying about that. I see his hand. I think they're both actually out, and I have a ton of gaps from that guy in the trap. That's so solid, honestly. And I'm getting these log rays shot on this man. Okay, that's bad. If I melee a Rinky here though, I actually will be able to grab my sharp five. So that's good. Poseidon keeps healing though. I don't know how many gaps they have. I think they're actually out of heads though. I'm just gonna boat them a bit here. If they push a Rinky, that's actually such a bad play by them. We can back them here for a free hit. The ring again. Yeah, Poseidon's pushing again. They're not bad, honestly. I just want to gap up again. Okay, Ringy's at two, actually. You know what? I'm going to go melee them. I just want to get sharp five here. They're protecting him, so he's... Oh, no. He's going to go kill him. If I push in for the stuff here, got the head. I'm just gonna eat it, I guess. I think he's out of heads. Oh, we, we got him. We definitely have more protection too, so that's also good. Hey, that's seven. Oh, he's out of healing. Okay, I won. All right, we made it happen. I think we played this game really well, to be honest. Oh, shit, we destroyed. Oh, my rod broke, that's why. Oh, I don't have a rod. Okay, that's bad. Whatever, I still got him here. No big deal. GG. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. So I think the game says the... What the... Oh, hi, X-Force. Welcome to the... Welcome to the outro. So I think this was one of my best games in terms of game sense. And I think I just played it really well all around. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.